Uh, the one thing that I've just decided to randomly look at whenever I put a bug in this thing is their eye. It's because you can really get really close to see single um, patches of omatidia and so it's just it's pretty cool to be able to get down on the level where you can actually select out an individual photoreceptor cell in a compound eye I think is pretty neat. If you're trying to do something like a eucentric analysis where you're trying to make rotations at the same time as you aren't changing the spot that you're focusing on, um, that can be a pain.